you are a part of God's family. Christian Daily Devotion Scripture Reference Galatians 4, 4 to 7 But when the fullness of the time was come, God sent forth his Son, made of a woman, made under the law, to redeem them that were under the law, that we might receive the adoption of sons. And because ye are sons, God hath sent forth the Spirit of his Son into your hearts, crying, Abba, Father, wherefore thou art no more a servant, but a son, and if a son, then an heir of God through Christ. Ephesians 3, 14, 15. For this cause I bow my knees unto the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, of whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named. The very reason Jesus died on the cross was to reestablish the sonship man lost in the Garden of Eden. Upon the death of Jesus, the whole of humanity regained its lost heritage. Beyond purchasing for us material and spiritual gifts, the blood of Jesus re-established us as children of God. We who were once estranged and now we have been adopted. The blood of Jesus is the seal on our adoption papers. Hallelujah! God decided in advance to adopt us into his own family by bringing us to himself through Jesus Christ. This is what he wanted to do, and it gave him great pleasure. Ephesians 1, 5. Our reading passage shows us that God himself has re-established the broken relationship with great delight. We therefore no longer must see or carry ourselves as strangers trying to reach out to an inaccessible God. God wants to be reached by you. Once we become born again, we immediately get enlisted into the family of God. We are no longer on the outside. We are now part of the family. All we must do is reach out into the loving arms of a willing father who has paid the price for our adoption into our heavenly family. I pray that the Holy Spirit will give you a personal revelation of your rightful place in the family of God. Prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for making me a part of your family. It is a great privilege to be your son. I am a child of God adopted into the family by the blood of Jesus. I am no longer a bound slave, but a free son. Amen.